okay so welcome to another section of now in this session we are looking at relative density now i did um a question on we did solve a question on relative density so if you haven't checked on that one just um check on your screen you will get it at the end of the video you will get it on your screen and check out that video also okay so the question is the density of, of lead of lead is um, 11,400 kilograms per meter cube and the density of water is just 1 times 10 to the power 10 to the power 3 kilogram per meter cube now the question says what is the relative density of lead now one thing about relative density is that relative density is just a ratio of the density of a substance to that of the density of water and one unique thing about relative density which differs from that of density is its unit relative density does not have units but density has units so we will see whether relative density has units or has no unit in this question so we have the question say we should find the relative density so now we have the density of the lead density of lead density of lead to be 11,400 11,400 kilogram per meter cube and we have uh, the density of water density of water we have density of water to be um, 1 and 0 times 10 to the power minus 3 kilogram per meter cube. So that is density of water. And we know our relative density is what we are actually looking for. So I say relative density. So relative density. So let's say how the relative density is the ratio of the density of a substance so the substance is lead so the density of lead to that of the density of water to that of density of water now in this situation we have to find the relative density so we know the density of lead to be this and density of water to be that so let's say you quickly say how, how the relative density is this density of lead which is 11,400 kilogram per meter cube and we have um, the density of water being 1 times 10 to the power minus 3 kilogram per meter cube so as you can see this takes care of that kilogram takes care of kilogram and we have um, 11,400 being divided by um, 10 to the power minus 3 so quickly we can um, in this situation we have um, 11,400 being divided by this which is this 11.4 so we have here so therefore our relative density here is just 11.4 and it has no unit no unit no unit take note take note of this take notes take note it has no unit it has no unit so basically that's what we have for um, the relative density thank you very much and also make sure to check out the, the next video on the relative density on your screen and please subscribe and hit the notification bell also if this is your first time on this channel thank you very much